Hello, my name is Dorian and I am currently a student in computer science. In this course you will learn how to create an application in the .NET environment using Visual Studio and C Sharp. You will be able to understand how classes work, how events work, how to realize a server-client database connection, how to use the model view controller software design pattern and some other object-oriented programming principles. For this course, I chose to create an application which manipulates quadrilaterals and displays information about them. Additionally, we will be able to connect to a quadrilateral database, which will allow us to add, to view, to update and to remove quadrilaterals. For now, I'm going to show you what this application does. The first point of interest is the quadrilateral drawing zone. In this zone, you can choose to draw up to four points, which will get connected and form a quadrilateral. This new quadrilateral will show its diagonals, its medians and some important points. For example, we can choose to create a quadrilateral like this. I'm going to put a point here, one here. As you can see, the points snap to this grid. So if I'm not really precise, I can put it here and here. And now I've got a pretty good looking quadrilateral. I got the diagonals, the medians, and some important points, like the intersection of the diagonals. The second point of interest is the data about quadrilateral panel. In this panel, we will see the data we want from the tools section about the quadrilateral. So let's say I want to see uh, the area and the parameter. Okay, I can now draw a quadrilateral and when I draw it, I see the area is 6400 and the parameter is 324. Another important thing is the database. Here we have a table with all the data in our database. We can always select a row and then we can choose something to do with that row. For example, we can view this quadrilateral. This quadrilateral has four points. The point coordinates are represented by X and Y position. So for example, the first point will be at the coordinate 200 and 140. If I want to view this, I will press the view quadrilateral and the quadrilateral will get will be drawn here. I can view another quadrilateral. I can update the quadrilateral. How do I do that? I draw quadrilateral and then I select the row I want to update, for example this, and I update it. Now if I view for example this row and I get back to my quadrilateral, I'll view exactly the quadrilateral I've drawn before. I can also remove a quadrilateral. Let's say I want to remove this one. I will select the row and click remove quadrilateral. And now the quadrilateral is no longer in the database. Also, if I want to add something to the database, I can easily draw a quadrilateral and click on the add quadrilateral. The new quadrilateral is added with the ID of 27. And last but not least, we can select the matrix size and we can change our language. For example, let's choose the size of 40. If we choose 40, it means that each square will have 40 pixels. These squares have 20 pixels each, so the squares will get doubled in size. Let's see, if I press grid size, yes, most of the squares disappear. Okay, if I want to change the language, for example, I will be able to select this French flag and uh, the language is changed to French. If I want Romanian, I can select this. If I want English back, I can select this. And also, if I draw a quadrilateral, I can reset the drawing. Well, I hope I've piqued your interest. I will see you during the course.